Hey guys, uh, Ben again here, doing another quick uh, unboxing video for another uh, handmade leather wallet. This one comes from uh, kind of my area, actually it was only about a half hour, 45 minute drive um, to get this play, to get this one. Uh, most of my wallets I order online, and although this company does have the uh, website and everything where you can order it online, it was nice to kind of get out and go to a nice, you know, storefront, you know, that, that sells this stuff. So if you guys ever have the chance or opportunity to support local, you know, go to a shop that has this stuff, uh, it, it's really cool to see everything in person and they could even show you how they make it sometimes in some places. Um, and, and, and of course the aroma, the smell is, is intoxicating. So, uh, but let's get into it. This is the range, uh, leather company out of Laramie, Wyoming. And I went in and picked up a wallet, specifically this wallet. This is their Haze wallet. It is just a, uh, it is a bifold wallet, but it is a vertical bifold wallet, which is kind of neat. Um, holds four to 12, or four to 14 cards. Uh, saddle stitch. Yeah, cool stuff. All right, uh, let's see. About the company so the wallet the leather uh, full grain leather sourced from Horween uh, in Chicago Illinois so it's good leather um, good tannery uh, so everything is done right here from the tannery to uh, you know doing the leather punching it and creating it it was really cool they weren't uh, like because uh, I picked this up on the weekend so even though the storefront was open you could see their shop and they weren't uh, working uh, there was actually a fair going on like right outside it was pretty neat uh, but they weren't like uh, stitching or working or anything. They were just kind of selling. Um, but you can go in and, and see them do all that stuff during the week, which is cool. Uh, lifetime guarantee. Uh, yeah. And then you can kind of see this is their shop. This is their storefront. So the building, like downtown Laramie. Laramie is a college town. And so um, a lot of history there. So the building, it says... Built in the 1890s and renovated in 2020. So it's a new storefront. These people have not been around for very long. Uh, so they are fairly new. Uh, handmade leather goods company. Uh, but do they kill it? I mean, they have bags, accessories, earrings, watch straps, and of course wallets. And that's what we're going to be looking at. So, of course, they, they asked me if I just wanted to carry it out. I was like, no, that's all right. So they just put it in this bag for me, which seems like all wallets do. So this is it. This is um, the Hayes wallet. It is a bifold, vertical pockets, and they've got uh, two cash slots, so it looks like you can fold it in half. Um, they even gave me a million dollars, so... That's pretty cool. Um, this is pretty thick too. I don't know what ounce leather this is, um, but this is actually kind of beefy, um, which I, I, I like. So it was between this and they also offer a money clip and I, I was really tempted to get the money clip, um, but it was something about the design that was kind of throwing me off. And I couldn't, I don't know, I, I wasn't like a huge fan, but then uh, I was with my fiance and she picked this up and right away I was attracted to it. Um, beautiful color, beautiful stitching, super nice full grain leather sourced from Horween. It is just, and it smells really great. Um, but this is, this is beefy. This is really nice. Um, so yeah. Uh, cash just gets folded up uh, once. You just fold it in half. You tuck it behind here. Um, it says that it holds uh, what was it? Four to fourteen cards. Or I mean, that's I can imagine like fourteen cards or ten cards. I mean, this thing is gonna get kind of beefy, but it can hold all that stuff, so that's neat. Um, and they gave me like. And I picked it, like I said, I picked this out of their storefront, so they didn't ship it to me. This is just, like, how I picked it up. Um, yeah. Pretty neat. 
they got all kinds of all kinds of stuff um like i said so they also got bags um you know nice like crossbodies or tote bags um earrings watch uh, apple watch uh, straps um and i think they're apple watch straps they have like a black accent on like this light leather it's so cool um really really neat um but they also do hats with like um like uh, leather patches on the front and so you can actually send in your own design or your own logo like a company logo um and they will you know you can place like a bulk order uh and they can send it out to you with your logo on like a you know a full grain like leather patch stitched onto a hat which is super cool um but this is their logo which is like a mountain range um because that's kind of where we're at is you know with the mountains and stuff um but yeah super cool um i'm going to leave their information in the description below so that you guys can go check them out um i i really like um putting a spotlight on you know uh handmade leather goods uh or companies that maybe you know aren't super popular i guess i don't know um i've done a couple of them before um but this one like i said i i mean they say that their building opened up in 2020 and i think i talked to the guy there and he said it was like a year and a half so two years um i mean so they're pretty new but i mean if you look at the quality of this and where they're getting their leather from they're gonna be around for a while because their their quality their craftsmanship um is is awesome so um but that's it quick video today i just wanted to kind of show you show off this new wallet that i got excited to carry it around uh for however long we'll see um but uh yeah if you guys have any questions about it please let me know uh if you guys like the video like it uh that help out um or you can leave a comment um, if you guys ever want to see any updates on any of the wallets I carry, um, see what they look like, please let me know. I did just do an update video showing off um, my uh, pop-off traditional bifold and the uh, Open Sea Leather Gun Deck wallet, which that one got some sweet patina, so I recommend going and checking that out. Um, but yeah, so I guess I will see you guys in the next one. Uh, and again, if there are any you know other products or any other companies that you want me to check out, please let me know. Uh, and I'll be more than happy to do so. Thanks. Bye.